All right, we're back. We're back. We just finished talking to pretty sure the whole crew. Now we're just gonna go do the Novaria mission. Figure out some more Geth stuff. And then hopefully that brings us closer to, uh, you know, impressing Ashley, a Liara, or a. Whatever. <laughs> I forgot her name. But she means a lot to me. I'm probably going to take Rex and uh, Liara. Forgot we already landed. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer realized, is okay, ashore. No, 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 no. Exo Presley has the deck. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination. Liara is probably the better uh, Log. companion. For the commanding this. officer. Especially because she she might have a lot of uh, guest dialogue. Dang, sorry, Rex. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. <laughs>
as the uh, armor, but logged. I'm stuck with the it. commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. That's far enough. We're not here to cause problems. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. You first. We're the law here. Show some respect. I'm Captain Maiko Matsuo, Ilanis Risk Control okay. Services. Is that Mits? Miss Matsuo or Mrs? All you need to know is I have more credentials than you. They plan to be trouble, ma'am. I can't let you enter the port area without confirmation of your identity. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. It would not be wise to search for the Geth unarmed. Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock! We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. One, two, Captain Matsuo, stand down. We confirm their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Yeah, that was crazy. Clara san will meet you upstairs. <laughs> Behave yourself. That could have made that way easier, but... It's a little bit of both, huh? <laughs> Paragon and Renegade. Hey, sorry about that, uh... Michael. I'm sure parasini san will answer any questions. Maybe you a have. dinner and a drink. Drink and dinner. Whatever you want. I'll make it up to you. The sooner we are off this frozen world, the better. I am Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. Oh. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. Is that Mrs. Parasini or I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I can't have my investigation hampered. Tread lightly. The board can bury you in litigation. You'd need an Asari lawyer to see the case through. Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? An Asari matriarch passed through a few days ago. Lady Benezia. Benezia? She is here? Can I speak with her? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Research complex. <laughs> what? Good. Give us directions and we'll be on our way. You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's office. She is here. I can't believe it. I imagine you want to talk to me, Shepard. About my mother. No, I don't. I trust you, Liara. You may not be military, but you're part of my crew. Thank you, Shepard. That means a great deal to me. <laughs> Playing a long game. Welcome to Port Hanshan, the galaxy's most respected site for independent scientific research and development. For your own safety and to protect the privacy of others, you are required to obey any directions given by our security personnel. If you have questions or concerns, our friendly administrative staff is always available. Thank you, and enjoy your stay. Hmm. The managers warned us about you. I can't believe the paranoids that work here. There's no accident on Peak 15. This one offers greetings. 
You are the specter that visits Port Hanchan. News travels fast here. Indeed, esteemed specter. Your arrival was not greeted with any joy by the companies here. This one has a burden that you could ease. If an arrangement could be made, it would compensate you. This one has procured a special item for a customer. The item is not permitted within the station, but you could bring it through customs. You want me to use my status to smuggle for you? That is not inaccurate. I won't carry anything if I don't know what it is. This one must be discreet. Rest assured, the contents pose no threat to anyone within this port. I want to know where this package is going. This one's customer prefers to remain anonymous. I'd be stupid to do this without knowing I'm not equipping my own enemies. Your words are not unreasonable. The customer is the Krogan called Inamorda. That one is a bounty hunter of some repute and quick to anger. You understand this one's urgency. That other grows restless from the delay. Damn, I should have brought, um... I have no problem that. with that. This one humbly thanks the specter. The package will be delivered to your vessel. All you need do is bring it to this one. Please do not mention this to Administrator Analeas. That one would levy... fees. Is there anything else this one might help you with? Could I buy something now? Is there anything in particular the Spectre is looking for? Greetings, Spectre. Have you brought the package? I'm here to shop. We can discuss this later. Of course. This one apologizes for inconveniencing you. The managers warned us about you, Spectre. You're the Spectre, right? Um, management told us not to talk to you. Alright, let's go back to here for a little bit. Don't make us regret letting you keep those guns. Try me. Try me. Try me. I mean, I doubt there's going to be anything else here, but...
Whoa. Does she have two, two toes and one baby toe? Alright, I can dig it, I can dig it. You know what I mean? Excuse me, I need a moment of your time. <laughs> uh. My people have dealt with the corporations on Novaria in the past. They pay well and they don't ask any questions. The male human at the hotel bar? He's a sales rep for Binary Helix. His name is Raphael Vargas. I need you to speak with him. Do you know who I am? Everyone here knows who you are, Dullstone. That makes you ideal for my job. You are a known quantity, or so Vargas will think. He will assume you are here to investigate his company's dirty laundry. That will distract him from your, my, real intentions. He's right there. Why not talk to him yourself? I wish I could. I already bungled this myself. He realized I was not a real buyer. I don't know anything about Binary Helix. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What is your city's interest in Binary Helix? They do not manufacture amps. Much of BH's work relates to biotics. There are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. Powerful ones. Commandos, to be specific. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. You will present yourself as a buyer, on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance. Discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate Binary Helix when he logs onto their intranet. What's in it for me? Money, of course. I would be well paid for this. So would you. 500 credits. Interesting plan. I'm in. Excellent. Here is the cracking device. You will know it is done when it beeps. I have assembled a dossier on Vargas. If you would like, I could brief you on his behavior patterns. Tell me what you know about Vargas. He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. If you see that, press him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. I'm not going to help you. I've got other things to do. Then I will find someone else. But I doubt you will find another job that pays 500 credits to listen to a salesman. Sorry, I shouldn't get involved in this. Here's your cracking device. Thank you. You will not see me again, Spectre. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm just gonna rock with that decision. Afternoon. Sit down, have a drink. What can I do for you? Who might you be? Lorik Keen. For the moment, I am the manager of the Synthetic Insights office. For the moment? Mr. Analeas closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of rents. I sense a connection there. Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeas' actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. Why didn't Analeas cancel your pass clearance? <laughs> Why should he? <laughs> There's nothing outside but snow and hungry Nathak. How did you get a pass? I'm a manager. Most executives on Novaria are free to come and go as they will. You have a plan? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? 
Violence against Mr. Analeas's thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. If he's paying them under the table, they're mercenaries. I can kill mercenaries. Excellent. Here is my pass into our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD contains an encryption key to access it. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep bloodstains off the carpets, would you? What sort of office is that? Good. I don't think I'm supposed to. You're the specter, right? Management told us not. Can I help you? Can I help you? <laughs> I guess I never get to talk to him. Can't even warn him, huh? They're after you, Raphael. Don't hang up. Elder brother, it's me. I'm on Navaria now. I can't talk long. This call is costing 10 credits a minute. It's real time from the Traverse. Did you think it would be cheap? I need some information. There's an issue here with synthetic insights. The manager, Laura Keen. He got caught with his toes wet. The office is closed by Hanshin's administrator. I, I need you to see what you can find out about... Are you ready for his name? Ronadril, Gan, Swa, Folsum, Karathin, Nar, Eadi, Belan, Laius. No, that's the administrator. The Hanshin administrator. Well, think about it. A Turian wouldn't risk getting his office closed. They don't compromise their team. That's drilled into them from boot camp. I think the administrator is using this keen fella to draw flies from his own clutch. Of course I could look it up myself. But do you think I'm likely to get any unfiltered data through Novaria's own network? That, and it would take forever for any out-system search results to get back here. Thank you, Elder Brother. I have to go. Yes. I'll speak to you soon. Okay, okay. Very low-key conversation right there. I've heard Opal has something for you. Like I care that you know? You his courier or something? Yes, but I haven't picked up his cargo yet. Hmm. Sit down a minute. I have a business proposal. I'm paying the Hanar more than I want. I'll bet he's paying you less than you want. Sell it to me directly. An intriguing offer. Perhaps you'll see me again soon. We'll make the right decision. Nice, nice. Doubling the money, huh? Okay. Low mission. I'm sorry. The hotel is off limits to those without a corporate account. Sure, sure.
Spectre, right? Yeah, that's me. I used to be a military. I like his suit. Except for my Eco's people, everyone's too corporate here. They just sit around sipping expensive water. So what can I do for you today? You seem like you have an ear to the ground. What's happening around here? There's the problems up on Peak 15. Synthetics Insights was shut down by Analeus. And a matriarch came through. Do you know where that matriarch is now? You looking for her? She took a shuttle to Peak 15 before we lost contact. What sort of problems are there at Peak 15? Don't know. There's a blizzard up there, but we've had those before. Never cut the satellite uplinks before. 15's always had a lousy reputation. Nobody talks about what they do there. And everyone sent up comes back a little quieter. What was that about synthetic insights? Scuttlebutt says Laura Keen was on the take. Sinalea shut down SI's offices. Quiet like, so no off world lawyers come in on it. What do you do here? I'm the chief mechanic for Hanshan. Just call me Lee. Humans have a problem saying my full name. Got a team of twelve under me. I was about keeping to say. the shuttles coming and going. How can I get into the garage? You need a pass. You can get one from Analeas or the managers. If you can polish enough gizzard. Maybe you could let me borrow yours? Sure. If I wanted to lose my job and get sued into the next spiral arm, security tracks card use. I have to go. You need anything? I'll be here. Access to the garage is restricted. I'm on Citadel business. I need to leave the station. If you want to enter the garage, you need authorization for Mr. Analeas. No exceptions. I'm sorry. Please, Hanshan Security. This office is sealed. Lorik Keen gave me a pass in. Keen? Are you working for him? He's under investigation. Analeas is paying you to shake this place down. Does Captain Matsuo know you're here? Hey, I'm not the one who wants Keen. Analeas has a Varen up his ass about this guy. How about this? You pretend you didn't see us, we'll pretend we didn't see you. Bro, is that Rosie Perez, bro? I'm genuinely uh, interested or confused. I don't know. Sounds like Rosie Perez, right?
Okay, a little another side mission. Alright, and then I guess a mission that spawns later. That they show me now for some reason. Alright. Do not be fooled by these civilized surroundings. This is a place of secrets and lies. Mm, okay. <laughs> Gas laptop. You download the evidence from Lorig's computer. You download it. Okay. Low typo, I assume. So we got that. Look, this looks like the first Mac laptop ever. That's a big boy. <laughs> 